Hello everyone, welcome back to the vlog. I'm not sure if I'm gonna upload this before Vlogmas starts or it's Vlogmas. If it's Vlogmas, happy Vlogmas. It is November 18th, 19th, 18th, 19th. And there is a holiday bazaar going on on post. So I thought I would take you guys with us. Not sure how much footage I'm allowed to like actually vlog within the bazaar. But if I get some, yay. If not, I will totally share everything that we buy. Our bazaar is actually in the gym. There's actually a stand outside. I wonder if it's glue vine. We only got one bag worth. Let me see. Part two is at the next gym. Done. We didn't buy a cuckoo clock, but I did really want one. And surprisingly, they were like pretty cheap there. So you're gonna regret it when I buy one that's that's four thousand. <laughs> yeah. Um, I've seen some at like in Rothenburg that are so expensive. So. I'm gonna get one either way, one day. But yeah, we got some stuff, so I'll share it whenever we get upstairs. Hopefully Charlie won't wake up while I'm showing you. Polish pottery is a big thing at our bazaars. So I got my mom this, which hopefully by the time I post this, she'll, um, she'll have this. So if not, surprise, we got my mom this because last year she bought one. She actually went to our bazaar last year with us and she bought one and then it broke in the mail. So I'm gonna like bubble wrap the crap out of this when I send it to her for her birthday slash Christmas gift because we got her something in Murano too. We got her a paperweight in Murano as well. So anyways, we got a butter dish because how cute is this? And it also matches. Can you hand me the, the honey dish? This is what my mom bought us last year. So it matches with a little honey bee on top. How? <laughs> you hear that? And then we wanted to get a little Christmas house because that's, this is what I'm gonna start collecting this year at Christmas markets are these little houses because I'm gonna start a village because my mom has always had a village, like a light up village in her, like under the Christmas tree. So we're gonna start that tradition. Did she just fart? So we got this cute little house and you put a little tea light in the back. Okay, Charlie, we get it. <laughs> so yeah, I'm excited. I wanna go to Poland before I leave and I might just go by myself one day. So yeah, that's everything we got at the bazaar. I hope you enjoyed the little clips that I got because I don't know if I'm allowed to vlog there, so. Anyways, oh, here, this is the place. This is the place that's always at our bazaars. So if you're interested, go to their website and order some stuff. I'm so excited about this. Look at this together. Ah, you're kidding. I'm gonna deck our whole house in Polish pottery one day. I wanted to add on to this vlog because it was pretty short. So it has now been two weeks. It is now November 29th and I can't get this open. So I am going to go Christmas shopping again, just like the bazaar. So it'll be a Christmas shopping vloggy vlog. I think I'm gonna go to TK Maxx first. Are you surprised? Probably not. So this is our Broken Center. Basically our mall. I've talked about it a couple times, but just thought I would show you kind of the outside part of it.
I cannot wait to show you guys what I got. But I just wanted to say, if you thought that vlogging in public in the US was weird, try vlogging in public in Germany. Because people stare at you if you're normal and not doing anything weird, you know? And I don't mean to say that to say that like I'm annoyed or anything by people staring. I am so used to it by now, it's not even a big deal. It is just to say that people here are not distracted by anything when they're walking around. Like people here are very aware of everything that's going on around them, if that makes sense. Like not to say that they're like more hyper vigilant or anything, it's just like people are not looking down at their phones as much as I noticed in the States. Vlogging in public is, I am just not good at it. Like I'm just simply not good at it. And I am also that kind of person that like really wants to blend in with German people. Like I don't want to stand out as an American and me holding up a camera in front of myself, talking to myself in the middle of a TK Maxx, definitely an American, I feel like. While we're already talking about differences between the US and Germany and things that I'll miss about Germany, this is so little and so like not a big deal, but I will miss the fact that lights, like traffic lights, go from green to yellow to red. And then when they turn back to green, they go green, they go red, yellow, green. I'm gonna miss that. If y'all wanna know everything I'm gonna miss about Germany, let me know, because I will totally make that video. I think about it literally 24 seven. So I have lots of ideas. I'm gonna do a haul in front of the Christmas tree. You wanna see everything I got? Oh, you showed me your toy. She got a Thanksgiving friend's turkey. I'm gonna let her do that so she doesn't rip it, but Charlie, you gonna do a haul with me? I have never been someone who decorates the bathroom for Christmas because why? But I am this year. Let's see, Charlie. So, this is an extra long bath mat. She loves rugs, like loves rugs and towels. Okay, that's enough. We got a short one for outside of the shower. Ho, ho, ho. I think they're two different reds, but I don't really care because I was going to get the long one no matter what so that it fit both of our sinks. The one we have now doesn't, so. I bought her this for Christmas. Charlie, it's not right now. You're not gonna remember this, so. Okay, okay, sit. Okay, I gotta put this back in the bag. I got new table chargers things. We call them placemats. <laughs> These are so cute, aren't they? I love them. So, and the ones we have now, Jake was like, why do you have those down? So I got new ones. Then I got these for the bathroom as well. I'm sure these are kitchen towels, but I don't really care. Um, these little red Christmas towels. Then I got these for our Christmas tree because I don't know where I saw these, but I really wanted to get like icicles for our tree. So I don't know, wait, are they this way? I don't know, but I thought they were cute. So, and they were only, $6.99. That's everything for this vlog. I hope you enjoyed my Christmas shopping vlog. Happy Vlogmas day two. I really hope you enjoyed this video and I will see you guys tomorrow for day three. Bye.